Hey there, welcome to Light of Fun. My name is William. In this episode, I want us to just see how we can be able to la run multiple instances of Laravel on the same machine. Sometimes you may have created an API that is supposed to communicate with another uh, website. And in this case, you may want to install the application on the same local environment and have the two um, website communicate to each other. For us to be able to install that, we can be able to run our application, the first one in the normal way, which usually runs on port 8000. And then we can modify the, the value of the port to maybe 881, eight, uh, 8080, or any value four digit in, the, in, the, in that range. And then we can be able to run two applications, three applications, four applications even, on the same one single machine at the same time. So let us go ahead and do that. I have terminal for the two websites. So we have website one and we have website two. And inside this website, in the landing page, I have indicated one to be website one and the other one to be website two. So let me go ahead and uh, run them and then we can be able to see what exactly happens. So on website uh, one, I would just like to, because I have changed directory using um, git bash to the specific uh, folder in htdocs, so I can just run php artisan serve. And of course, this one is running on port 8000. This other one, I want to run php artisan serve. And now I want to have a flag and be able to declare the port. So I can be able to say port hyphen hyphen port is equals to, and then I can put the name of the port. Let me just even put 8001 like that. So if I click enter, as you can see, this one is also running on port 8001. So website one, port 8000, website two, 8001. So let us visit it here. Look, so localhost 8000, as you can see, we have, I have called it website one. And then if we visit localhost 8001, and now you can see we have website two. And basically that is how you can be able to run multiple instances of different Laravel applications on the same machine at the same time. Thank you very much for following this tutorial video up until this point. Subscribe to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it. And you can also uh, share your comments in the comment section. Thank you very much.